Spanning 170 kilometers from the Neil Mountains through desert valleys to the Red Sea is what will be the line in Saudi Arabia, an architectural marvel that reaches a towering height of 500 meters above sea level, yet maintains a space efficient width of 200 meters. The line reshapes the idea of urban advancement and offers a glimpse into a futuristic city. Representing a revolutionary shift in civilization, its unmatched quality of life is now to explore at the line exhibition inviting visitors in Riyadh to experience its wonders firsthand. In 2022, Saudi Arabia revealed plans for its ambitious urban endeavor known as The Line. Conceptualized as a singular, vertical city within the desert, projected to extend across 106 miles and accommodate a population of 9 million people. To almost envision the idea that they want to say that they're going to have 9 million people eventually living in this city, which is really just a building. This visionary concept comes from the Neom Project, a grand scale initiative that reportedly is still years away from realization. Prospective futuristic metropolises propose for placement in the northwestern region of the Gulf Nation, beside the shores of the Red Sea, as announced by Crown Prince Mohammed bin Salman. The line plans propose a vertical city with a width of 200 meters designed to rise to an elevation of 500 meters above sea level, encompassing a sprawling area of 34 square kilometers as outlined in the official press release. This innovative concept aims to redefine urban development. In recent years, Saudi Arabia has embarked on this ambitious journey to transform its cities and urban landscape with the flagship project known as The Line taking center stage. Throughout all of history, we've actually seen people, dreamers, thinkers who've wanted to create those visions of how we might live in the future. The line aims to redefine urban living, sustainability, and technology in a truly groundbreaking manner. The line was unveiled as part of Saudi Arabia's broader development initiative, the NEOM Project, which aims to create a futuristic, sustainable, and technologically advanced urban environment in the northwest region of the country. The line serves as a pivotal piece of NEOM's vision. At its core, the line is envisioned as a 170 kilometer long urban linear development set amongst a stunning natural landscape. Landscape. The project aims to address several key challenges faced by traditional cities such as congestion, pollution, and inefficiency. By creating a purpose-built linear urban space, the line would strike a harmonious balance between human needs and environmental preservation. One of the line's defining features is its commitment to sustainability. The project aims to achieve a carbon neutral footprint by relying on renewable energy sources and advanced technologies. The line's transportation system will be fully autonomous and powered by clean energy, reducing the reliance on traditional vehicles and minimizing air pollution. Additionally, the city's infrastructure will be designed to conserve water, minimize waste, and integrate nature seamlessly into the urban fabric. The design philosophy of the line centers around walkability and accessibility. The city will be built around a 20-minute walkable radius, ensuring that residents have easy access to their workplaces, schools, healthcare facilities, and recreational spaces. This design approach not only promotes physical well-being, but also fosters a sense of community and connection among its residents. There's a good chance that it won't work at all. Another aspect of the line is that it's set to be a pioneer in the integration of smart technologies. It's going to serve as a testing ground for emerging technologies such as AI, IoT, and 5G networks, aiming to enhance the quality of life for those who live here. Smart sensors and data-driven systems will optimize energy usage, traffic flow, and public services, creating an efficient and responsive urban landscape. This emphasis on technology also hopes to showcase Saudi Arabia's broad our goals of becoming a global hub for innovation and technological advancement. Each day it has to be excitement to finish your work and go and enjoy it in New York. So we are competing with Miami. If the line actually works out and goes to plan, its focus on sustainability, technological innovation, and holistic urban design sets a precedent for other urban projects to follow in the future. As the line emerges as a model for sustainable living, it could inspire cities around the world to rethink their approaches to urbanization, especially in the face of mounting environmental challenges. 
However, critics have cast doubt on whether the project is technologically feasible, while others have described the vision was unveiled in a flashy promo as dystopian. The line is proposed as part of a Saudi rebrand plan called Vision 2030 to rival its Gulf neighbors including Dubai and Abu Dhabi as travel hotspots and reshape the kingdom's economy. Aiming to reach 100 million annual visitors by the close of the decade, they're hoping the surge would boost the local economy billions of dollars. It's huge. I, I, I wish that I can explain it uh, in a smaller uh, way, but it's project making money. It's project absorbing the demand. While there are many doubters, in June 2023, some satellite images of the line's progress were revealed, showing that construction was indeed underway. It's being built in the Tabuk province of northwestern Saudi Arabia, and two new images analyzed by SOAR, an online digital atlas, show new developments here. In one image, which shows the central part of Neom, there appears to be a significantly expanded work around the main construction base of the project including several new buildings in the base village. There is also excavation activity and ground movement, according to SOAR. In comparison to Google Maps satellite images taken before the project's construction, when the desert area was untouched, this activity appears to be in the shape of a horizontal line. Furthermore, there appears to be a mining operation and earthworks near what will be Neom's Tourism Visitor Center. The second image taken from the eastern part of Neom on the Plateau Heights showed earthworks that clearly resembled a straight line. This could be deep excavation to prepare access to basement rock in the western areas of the new city. The new developments pictured in 2023 include the removal of a tower on a power line in the area, likely part of the new city's continued expansion. While specific completion dates for the line haven't been provided, the Neom initiative seems to be advancing at a rapid pace, so it's expected that various phases of the line will be completed in the coming years. The line is not supposed to be just a city, it's a paradigm shift in urban living. With its commitment to sustainability, smart technology, and harmonious integration with nature, the line sets the stage for a new era of urban development. Well, if all goes to plan. While exact completion dates may evolve over time, the journey toward creating this revolutionary urban environment is well underway. And the world is eagerly watching to witness the birth of a future forward cityscape that redefines what's possible. Possible. Thanks for watching. I'm Kara the Vampire Slayer, and I'll see you all in another video. Bye!